So I'm creating this video here to show you how you can set up what's called Chrome Persons in the Chrome browser. You can do something like this similar in Firefox too, but if you're wondering what the heck is a, a Chrome Person, what that is is in Chrome, you can set up where you, you basically have two different accounts, three different accounts, however many accounts you want, all set up so that you can toggle back and forth easily between the separate accounts without having to log back in and out of different Google accounts all the time. And that can be a problem too uh, when you're trying to use one Google account and then the last pass password manager associated with it as well as like your CRM or any other softwares associated with that particular Google account. So for example, like if you have your own personal Gmail account and you have your own Zapier account and your CRM and all that kind of stuff, Facebook, you have all that with the password information stored in that one account, but then you also have a Google uh, login for your employer or your clients or whatever. If you want to have it where those logins associated with all those accounts are easily uh, attainable by just by simply getting over to that other Google account without having to log uh, log in and back and forth, um, I'm going to show you how you can do that. It's super simple and easy. Let's get this done. So in Chrome, what you're going to do is. When you go up here to the little three dots here to expand from menu options, you're gonna to go to, uh, sorry, you're gonna click on your little avatar up here for your Google account that's right beside the, the menu options. So click on the, the avatar here. You can see I've got different uh, persons listed in here, like little different icons and then names and so forth. So these are the different like client accounts or my own accounts and so forth. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and click on add here. So if you've never done this before, you probably only have like one account showing up in here. But I'm gonna go ahead and click on add. And then just give this a name. So this would be like my client's account. Uh, this is my inbox that I have for a client's account. So in Infinity Marketing Group. So give it a name that will make, make sense to you um, when you're toggling back and forth between those different Chrome persons. Um, later on, so let's, let's go ahead and click on add. If you put your name every single time, then it's kind of hard to differentiate. That's why I wanted to put the client's name in there. So let's go ahead and click on add. And then you could go ahead and log in here. Uh, I gotta go grab that password real quick. Last pass. So this pain of having to go get the password, that will be solved here really quickly where I don't have to worry about this now that I've set up this Chrome person once I've logged in here. And then you wanna click on link data and then turn on yes, I'm in. Then you should be good to go. If you needed to add in any um, bookmarks or anything like that, you could. I already have bookmarks added in for this Google account. Not a lot, just a couple. Um, you could always import your uh, your bookmarks and so forth. You could add in LastPass, all that kind of good stuff. And then uh, this is showing an error just because I have uh, a vast antivirus stored on this computer and I have to just go in here and, and um, either accept or approve that. But basically, now if we go back up here to my little avatar that I have set up for my account, you can see I've now got, um, it's gonna show up in here if I go and toggle back and forth between these different accounts. So let me just click really quickly into my company's account. And then you can see if we go back, see it's, it's just a matter of going in here and getting into these other accounts. So here's that one we just set up, that Infinity Marketing Group client account. So I can quickly go back and forth without having to log back in and out of Google. And then if I had like a Facebook account set up for this or CRM or something like that, I could quickly and easily get in here and I'd have all my uh, login information stored in LastPass. And there's no reason for me to have to log in and out of Google so many times. This is a lifesaver. All right, guys, if you have any questions, let me know.